Tonight we are learning new details about the arrest of two men and the death of a Cal State Northridge student whose body was found Friday off the 10 freeway in Palm Desert. KCAL 9's Brittany Hopper is live in the newsroom with the developments. Brittany. And Elsa, LAPD will only say two people have been arrested. I did talk to Abdullah's brother tonight, but because he is mourning, he won't go on camera. But he tells me the entire family is overcome with sadness. Ahmed Al Qadi, whose brother went missing last month, tells me no human being deserves to die like this, especially a man like him. Ahmed won't go on camera because he's mourning, but tonight he did speak to me extensively by phone, calling his brother's death a tragedy. 23 year old Abdullah Akari's body was found on the side of the road in Palm Desert on Friday. He went missing on September 17th after posting his car for sale on Craigslist. LAPD says officers arrested two people and that robbery homicide detectives are investigating his death. Ahmed tells me our parents raised us right and to always see the good in people, to trust people. Family members spoke to us via Skype from Saudi Arabia. He was like any other college kid, into cars, into making new friends. <sighs> Abdullah was an engineer major at Cal State Northridge. He was here on scholarship from Saudi Arabia. He comes from a very prominent family, and his brother tells me he had dreams of coming to America to do well in school, then go back to his country and make his parents proud. We're very devastated and we just hope justice will be served. Now, Abdullah's body is expected to be flown back to Saudi Arabia Thursday, where the funeral will take place. LAPD Chief Charlie Beck is expected to hold a news conference tomorrow to provide more details. Reporting live in the newsroom, Brittany Hopper, KCAL 9 News, back to you in the studio.